Hey guys, Stuart here, welcome back to this channel and thanks for dropping in if it's your first time here. Now today I'm going to dive into an updated Facebook Pixel tutorial for Wix and simply walk you through the step-by-step -step process of installing the Facebook Pixel onto your Wix website so that you can start tracking important events happening on your website. Okay, so before we dive into this brief Facebook Pixel tutorial, consider subscribing if you haven't done so already or if you're new to this channel and that way you'll stay updated with actionable videos and tutorials designed to equip you with the skills, knowledge and tools to help your small business thrive online. And with that quick note out the way, let's jump over to my computer and walk you through the simple process of installing the Facebook Pixel onto your Wix website. Alright, let's get into it. Okay, so just quickly before we get started, it's important to note that if you want to connect your Facebook Pixel with your Wix website, then you will need a premium Wix plan as well as a custom domain connected to your Wix website. Okay, so the first thing that we want to do is head over to our Ads Manager. Now to arrive here, you can simply head over to your browser and type in facebook.com forward slash ads manager and that should take you here. Then simply navigate up to the top and make sure that you have the correct account selected. Now if you currently do not have a business manager then what I'll do is link a beginner's tutorial up above and down below in the description that will guide you through the process of setting up your business manager inside Facebook. And your business manager is going to allow you to add and manage ad accounts. And within your ad account this is where you can create a new pixel. Okay, so once you've arrived inside your ads manager, simply navigate over to the left hand side over to all tools, click here. Then simply navigate down and locate events manager. Then simply navigate down to connect data. And then simply click web because we want to connect our Wix website to share activity that occurs online, including viewing content, add to cart and purchase events. So basically what we want to do is track all the important events happening on our Wix website when we run Facebook campaigns. Then simply navigate over to connect. And then here we want to name our pixel. So go ahead and name your pixel. Most likely you're going to name it your website and then pixel. We're going to go ahead and do that. Then once you have named your new pixel that we're going to install on our Wix website, simply go ahead and click create pixel. Then go ahead and simply add your Wix URL in here. And then once you enter in your Wix URL in the correct format, just like this, simply come down and click tick. Then click next. Then navigate up to conversions API and meta pixel. This is recommended. We want to connect this option up here. And down here you will see the pixel that we want to use. Now what we're going to do is log into our Wix website and set up the connection. So go ahead and log into your Wix website. Then once you've logged into your Wix dashboard, simply navigate down to marketing and SEO on the left hand side and then locate marketing integrations. Then simply find Facebook Pixel and CAPI, then come down and click connect. Then go ahead and click connect to Facebook. Then go ahead and select your profile. Then come down to grant permission to connect Wix marketing tools to Facebook. Then navigate up to Business Manager and make sure you have the correct Business Manager selected. And then select the pixel that we just created. What you want to do is make sure the ID is correct. Then come down and click Continue. Again make sure that you have the correct Business Manager selected and then you have the correct Meta Pixel selected. Then ensure that the Automatic Advanced Matching is turned on and then come down and click Continue. Then Wix is going to tell you what the Wix marketing tools are allowed to do. Then click Next. And congratulations, just like that you're all set. Now that you've connected your website to Facebook, you can help more people discover your business, find people who are likely to buy your products and services, measure the results of actions taken on your website. So go ahead and click Done. 
And congratulations, just like that, you connected Facebook Pixel with Wix. And now what we're gonna do is head back to our events manager inside Facebook, and then navigate down and click next, and next again, and then simply click close. And then simply navigate over to the far left hand side, come down and select data sources. And then click on the pixel that we just created, then navigate over to test events, then simply navigate down to test browser events and here what we're just going to do is add our website url then come down and click open website and that should open up your website now simply head back to your facebook events manager and as you can see a page on our website has been viewed what you want to do is also test all the different pages on your website to make sure that all your pages are being tracked properly then what we can do is navigate up to create and we can come down and click create a custom conversion and for example if you're selling products on your website then what you would do is navigate up to name and identify the name of this custom conversion add a description make sure that you have your pixel selected then ensure all url traffic is selected then navigate down to rules and then come down make sure you have url and contains selected and simply add the url of the success page that people arrive to once they've purchased a product on your website and that's going to track those conversions now if you're tracking form submissions so for example in lead generation then what you would do is click on contains and then select equals and add the URL of the thank you page that people arrive to once they've filled out their information and become a lead. Then simply go ahead and click create. So I hope that makes sense. Now you can start tracking events that are happening on your website when you drive traffic from Facebook using Facebook ads to your website. And as you can see, it's as simple as that to connect the Facebook pixel with your Wix website. And there we have it for this Facebook Pixel tutorial for Wix. Now, if you have any questions about this process, make sure to pop them down below. And with that said, thank you so much for watching this tutorial all the way through to the end. If you got value, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to this channel. And that way, I'll see you in the next video. Take care, guys.